Hello world! Welcome to quick tip number 23, simulated drone. One of those very handy features in DroneLink which nobody uses is simulated drone. And it's so convenient, I'll explain you how to use. In this sample I have two orbits on top of each other. When we look to the preview we have the known image. The only problem is the image is what actually what the camera sees. That is a good thing if you want to adjust your tilt and your angles, your heading and everything. But it's not showing what you actually want to see. More important, you cannot change any settings. If you click on the grey bar in the preview, you can change some settings. But you see it doesn't go very smooth. But say you don't want to fly over somebody else's property or maybe over a railroad or a waterway, then there is a better solution. If you click your right mouse button, like what you do when moving references, you also have simulate the drone. Click that one. Now you have a top view where you can see your drone and the focus point. You can drag both items to anywhere in the map you want. And you see in the preview window that your view is moving accordingly. You can just roam around. Very handy in 3D if you want to check your flight path. But what is really convenient is while you're watching this you can change all your parameters in the menu. Everything. When using the preview together with simulate drone, when you come to the field you know you'll always be on the good side. It's so much safer and so much quicker.